everybody. Welcome back to another video of El Jefe. Thank you for subscribing and thanks for watching. This is going to be a product review and what I'm reviewing is going to be Griot's Black Shine Tire and Trim Coating. Um, I've already seen a couple of reviews on this and uh, seen how well it does make the tire shine. The difference between my reviews, I think, and most of the reviews that I see online is that I'm going to also show you how long it lasts. So I'm going to spray it on my tire, drive it around a little bit, and then uh, you know, see if it lasts a couple of days, the last couple of weeks, you know. Uh, most tire shines or tire gels that you put on your tire, you know, lucky if they last a day or two. Um, so we'll see how this works. Now uh, this here is pretty simple. Uh, if you want just if you want a high tire shine, you spray it on there, you let it sit for 20 minutes um, before driving it. That way you avoid any sling up on the car. If you don't want the, the high shine but you want the protection, um, then you can just buff it off with a towel. Um, this stuff here is clear. Um, you can see it's not any kind of color, but I'll show you the shine that it does. And it does have uh, a little fruity smell. I've seen some reviews where they really get off on the smell of the stuff. It's not like I really care about it. I'm not smelling while I'm driving, so what do you care? And hoping that'll show up really good in the camera. Uh, sorry about the poor lighting conditions. Uh, now what I'm going to do is, it's not going to hurt any other your paint or coatings or anything, but I just like to wipe it down anyway. So I just wipe all the excess off. Uh, it does have a slight oily feel to it, uh, so we'll kind of see what happens. We'll see how well this shine looks, um, I believe I've seen this on uh, uh, dealer cars on the inside of the showroom floor, so I think this is probably what they use, so we'll see how well it holds up um, to the outside environment. I'm going to go ahead and put them on the other three tires, and then hopefully I'll be able to drive it around for a little bit, and I'll come back and I'll, we'll review it and kind of give you, uh, tell you how long it worked for, so that way you kind of know whether or not you want to spend your money on this. Oh, and I did get this from... Uh, Advantage Auto, when you pick them up at AutoZone or probably even Walmart, I uh, paid uh, $9.99 for it. So, uh, like I said, we'll see what happens. Thanks for watching. Okay, this is after one day, just driving around. Uh, local driving, no, no rain, just nice sunshine. So you can see some of the glosses, you know, just basically wore off from, the, from normal driving. But uh, one thing, like I said, I put this on and I let it sit for, I put it on in the evening and I let it sit for like 15 hours. And I don't know if you can see it, but you see all the little splotches on there on the matte vinyl wrap. That's where it slung it on there. So um, they talk about 20 minutes, let it sit for 20 minutes to avoid any, any sling on your car. Uh, well, that's not true. This thing has sat for 15 hours and I still got some sling on there. Now granted, like I said, you'd probably never be able to see it on regular regular paint. If you look, you really can't see it. The only reason why you can see it is because of the matte wrap, um, which shows up stuff like that. So most people probably wouldn't bother it. But anyway, so that's where we're at. Okay, one day. And it's still shiny. It's just not as shiny as it was when you first put it on. So, alrighty, we'll check back here and keep on checking back. Alright everybody, welcome back. It's been, uh, this is the final review of the Griot Black Shine Tire and Trim Coating. Um, it's been four days since I put this on here. Uh, I think you saw day one, day two, uh, day three was okay, but day four, um, I drove about 25 miles through some rain, and you can see nothing else on the tire, it all got washed off. So this stuff definitely is not hydrophobic, um, doesn't repel water, it just washes off. Um, I bas basically I guess I'll, I'll grade this on a scale of 1 through 10. Uh, uh, ease of application is definitely a 10, doesn't get any easier just to spray this stuff on the tires. Lasting, I would say if it if it didn't rain, it probably would have lasted two weeks. 
you you wouldn't have it didn't keep the shine that originally was on there i mean if this doesn't go anywhere for you know a couple of months it's going to maintain that shine it's not going to wear off like uh some other coatings do and stuff after you spray it on it dries and then it wears off this um, i can see it going weeks and maybe months if you never drive anywhere but as soon as you drive somewhere uh, you saw in the, the second video there where it did sling so, uh, some of the uh, gel off um, so i think it would maintain some kind of a shine to it uh, if i hadn't rained so i think i'm going to try this again in the uh, winter time when it's not in the rainy season here uh, and see how well it does then but uh, this definitely like i said uh, would it last a little bit longer i think than four days if i didn't drive uh, through the rain so this definitely isn't a product that you don't that you want to use during the rainy season might be better off um, like i said we'll see when winter time comes we'll see how it makes out so uh, let me know if you thought this video was helpful uh, you know i definitely won't use it again until like i said come the winter time you know, I'll probably try it on here again and see how long it lasts because it definitely had a real nice shine to begin with. So we'll see what happens. All right, hope this video helped you guys out and stay tuned for more videos. Thanks for watching.